We have an awesome video for you tonight, so we need those thumbs ups and subscribe if you haven't already because we did a little unboxing in the back room. In the back room. Back room. Back room. Back room. Back room. Back room. What are you, chicken? <laughs> That's totally the beginning of this video. <laughs> and there's more really cool stuff, so leave me some comments and thumbs ups. Wow. We got a few of tonight, just Price Final Records. And we're unboxing. No, but yes. not in front of you. We are unboxing back here and doing a flip through because there is so much stuff. Do you know why there's so much stuff? It doesn't look like a lot. It is a lot. There's One, a two, lot. three, there's a lot. And these are big boxes with lots of records. These big boxes weigh a ton. They, do. Mm -hmm. they really yeah. do. Yeah, it's crazy. So we could have some big release Friday stuff in here. We got restocks. We got spinaroundstore.com orders because, you know, you get all the stuff's available on spinaroundstore.com. It is? It is. What? Yeah. It is. Yeah. And if you just write us an email and actually tell us what you want us to put up there, we will do it. But if you just say there's stuff, I can't help you. What do you mean? Somebody wrote an email and said there's stuff that I want and it's not on the website. Hmm. And that didn't help me. What do you mean? You are totally a mind reader. I am so gotta, not a mind reader. Right? Engage that psychic I have, thing I have too many, too many minds to... Yeah, there's a massage where they actually massage your third eye. Oh, you gotta tap well, it. I need that. Yeah. You, you tap the middle eight times and it's supposed to open up your... Oh, God, I don't want to see it, man. <laughs> Imagine that thing pops out and it's a freaking alien. Is it there? <laughs> oh, like that episode of Charmed. That's what I'm saying, Yeah. Man. All of a sudden, you got like this giant booger coming out of your forehead. What <laughs> the? Yeah, like that. All right, well, you can at least start it. Okay. Let's, let's okay. see what you got. Okay. You know. All right. Oh, no. This is um, going to get messy and ugly. I'm almost too short for this, but... Me and Santa did the thing where we both reach up as high as we could, and I could go around the top of his finger. Yep. So I can reach farther than Santa. So you're trying to say you're taller than Santa? I am. Well, I'm not necessarily mm, taller than Santa, but. Hmm. Or, got... or is it, or is it? Did you shrink a little tiny bit? Well, as you get older, you do shrink. I, I hear. I yeah. Don't know. Yeah. I swear, my grandpa was six feet tall, and now I can look at the top of his head. That's what? a lot of shrinkage. First out of the box. <laughs> Led yeah, Zeppelin. A lot of shrinkage, Ken. Wow. <laughs> What second? What else you got? Arctic monkeys. Oh, we got 10 tons of that. Kendrick mm -hmm. Lamar. Damn. Damn. What you doing? We're all done. We're what? all done. Yeah, look at it all. Look at all this. That took like two seconds. Look at all we're this. Quick. We're quick. Man. We're so quick. Snap a finger and we're done. Holy cow. Mm -hmm. What you working with? Well, look, we got this Judas Priest from Record Store Day. Isn't that cool? Yeah, it was a Black Friday, I think. Mm -hmm. One I, of those drops. One of the drops. One of them. Oh, still Judas Priest. Okay, I'll get there. Hold on. Okay, now we got Freddie Gibbs. Wait a minute. Do you know why we got so many of those Judas Priests? Because they still had them? Because I bought them all now. Ah. I finally bought them all. Okay. I was procrastinating. I'm like, ah, do I really are want you, them all? Are you sure? Because they keep putting stuff on top of after you think you bought them all. Mm, I know. <laughs> I just bought Hobo Johnson, right? Mm -hmm. I bought I bought all of them. Mm -hmm. And then within one second after I bought them all, 25 more got listed. I was like, stop playing. <laughs> it happens. <laughs> Freddie okay, Gibbs. Still Freddie Gibbs. And then we have Busta Rhymes. Busta Rhymes. Busta Rhymes. Do you know when that's getting released? No. Friday. Friday. Yeah. <laughs> Bad Religion. DJ K Slay. Is this getting released too? I have Friday? no idea. Oh, okay. Billy Joel Piano Man. We got Prince, Sign of the Times. And this was for one of the Record Store Day drop things too. I got a confession to make. What's that? I didn't buy them all. Okay. Mm. Well, that's good because I think we still might have a couple. I know. Mm hmm. LA Guns, ooh, two LA Guns, The Police, Misfits, The Collection, Travis Scott, Five Seconds of Summer, Primetime, John Prine, The Smiths, um, Cowboy Bebop, Cowboy Bebop, Cowboy back Bebop. in stock. Mm -hmm. Very exciting, we got Kiss, Su Lift it up. Suicide, Silence. Silence. I believe, and it's limited to 1500 Cool. On bone, black, splatter, vinyl. Jizza. That's right. Jay-Z. More Jay-Z. And then we got Sufjan Stevens, Ultra Fox, Pepper, Local Motion. Pepper. Do the local motion with me. What? <laughs> Sid Vicious, this is being Friday, right? Yep. Search and destroy. It's his picture disc. Mm -hmm. He looks so good on there. That was upside down. We got Megadeth. Misfits, Nirvana, 
Front bottoms and then Green Day. Shenanigans. Shenanana? Shenanigans. Shenanana. Manat manat. What you working with, Santa? Okay, so we got some flaming lips. Flaming lips. And hand out of the way there, Blink 182. Beastie Boys. I tried to trick you. You did. I tried to trick you. <laughs> and I didn't look until now. I was going to try. That's funny. I played fair. <laughs> I, it, was, it was in this box over here. And I'm like, oh no, Santa. I, I got to put this in. I got to put the kamikaze in your box. You say I got to remember to look here. It's right there. Yes, because every week he's had kamikaze by Eminem. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and it looks similar. It looks very similar. Okay, so we got David Bowie. Got a bunch of those. Uh, Phil Collins. That's the picture disc. Yes, it is. Of his big old nose. Big old nose. <laughs> uh, dire Straits. White Snake. Uh, Leonard Skinner. Uh, bon Jovi. Poison. Got a few of those. You know why? Why is that? Because I'm thinking about possibly doing that as a deal with the ah, deck. Okay. That's right. Boston. Two of those. Billy Joel. A couple of those. This is uh, Young Blood. Young Blood. I can never remember that name either. Uh, Van Halen. Aerosmith. And who's this? Uh, Kings of Leon. Yep. And Pearl Jam. Pearl Jam. Mm, I was calling it Coldplay before. Because <laughs> it was all and yellow. And you thought it was King Gizzard. I know. Yeah. We're all messed up. So we've got Joji. 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 Not Nectar, Joji. Lift it up. So it says Nectar on the bottom. It was confusing the heck out of me. And I'm like, I don't think Nectar's putting out albums anymore. N-E-K. T-A-R. Nectar. Oh. Yeah. Is that what happened? Mm -hmm. Okay. Stevie Wonder, Mac Miller, Credence, Stone Temple Pilots, Pink Floyd, more Pink Floyd, a different Pink Floyd, uh, Jefferson Airplane, Hobo Johnson, mm -hmm. <laughs> Radiohead, Black Sabbath, Pearl Jam, Radiohead, and then we got Silver Chair. Now that Silver Chair is the different Silver Chair. Really? This Silver Chair, I believe, because it doesn't say silver on it, this is the multicolored one. Ooh. That's right. So I may be keeping all these for myself because I've been waiting for this one forever and ever and ever. And I already had a silver copy. I really I... want to see it spin on the turntable. What? It has to be so pretty. It's an epic album. I... You'll really like it. It's great alt rock. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like alt rock. What you working with, Sam? Okay. Uh, oh, there Doja she is. Cat. Doja Did I got that right? Okay. Pink vinyl. Anthrax. A few of those. Uh, Stevie Nicks. I never loved. Yeah. Uh, anthrax. anthrax. Yep, Anthrax. Uh, Rolling Stones. Fat Boy Slim. Now this is an indie exclusive for Fat Boy Slim. Ooh, it's on nice. yellow vinyl. Oh, nice. Yeah, a couple of those. Guns and Roses. Do you know what type of music Fat Boy Slim is? No, I don't. Do you know what type of music Fat Boy Slim is? It's is it electronic? Yes. Yeah. Is it really? Yeah, I remember yep. there's a there's a music video and I think somebody's in it. That dude dancing. Yeah, and I can't I can't remember his name. He's real tall. He was in Prophecy. Oh my gosh, what's his name? Let us know down in the comments because I don't know his name either. Can't Boom! Labyrinth. Yeah, Labyrinth. Definitely wasn't Bowie. No. Uh, Ace Frehley. He was loud. He was loud. Uh, Motorhead. Ace. Greta Van Fleet. A couple of those. Blink-182. A couple of those. Panic at the Disco. Fleetwood Mac. Queen. The Melvins. Jay-Z. Tyler the Creator. Billy Eilish. And another Billy Eilish. <gasps> Wow, Santa, that was fantastic. It really you was. You did. Man. So we've got Sergio Simpson, and it's the indie exclusive. And it's volume two. Volume two, Cut and Grass. And then we've got Abba, and they were live, they were live, they were live at Wembley. 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 Mmm, Wimbledon. <laughs> and then we have Jefferson Airplane, Bob Dylan and the Dead. See, restocks. Phil Collins. Ooh la la. Without Phil Collins' face on the really? front. I am so confused. Yeah, well, it's the next best thing. Wow. So confused. System of a Down, Cage the Elephant. Beach Boys, The Weeknd, got a couple of those, just a few. Florence and the Machine, Audio Slave, Prince, Purple Rain, and look, it's a picture disc. How cool is that? Flip it. Yep. Ha. All right. Limited edition. Of course, everything's Fantastic. limited edition. They stamped that limited edition on everything. Everything, well, everything is limited. No <laughs> Doubt, 25th Anniversary, Matchbox 20, Black Crows, Queen, Coldplay, More Queen, Arctic Monkeys, Led Zeppelin, and Kendrick Lamar. Nice. Okay. I'm up, huh? What are you working with? Okay, we got some Eagles. Eagles? Yeah. Fly like got a few eagles. of those. Alicia Keys. Now, uh, this box is disappointing. Outcast. Uh, yeah, another Outcast. Oh, upside down. That's why. 
But look, this is why this box is disappointing. Movie fingers? Oh, yeah. All the corners in this, well, in, in bunch pretty of, much, yeah, yeah, a bunch of the box. And then we have Bruce Springsteen, a few of those. Another Bruce Springsteen. I know. Uh, Bruce Springsteen again. Another Bruce Springsteen. Bruce Springsteen, King Gizzard and the Lizard Wizard. Bruce Springsteen. Bruce Springsteen. Metallica. Uh, Bruce Springsteen. That is Bruce. I couldn't see down there. There it is. Okay. Uh, Tame Impala. Uh, Devo. Uh, Billy Eilish. Uh, Old Dirty Bastard. Old Dirty Bastard. Okay. I didn't recognize that one. Green Day. Green Day. Uh, Leah Ford. Uh, five Seconds of Summer. Five Seconds of Summer. I don't really know them. That's a bunch Newer of pop band. Uh, Cinderella. Uh, five fingered. S S oh no, it just over down. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, that one bad, didn't I? Bruce. Bruce again. Another Bruce. Alice in Chains and Bruce Springsteen and Bruce Springsteen. <laughs> what? That's, that's, a that's a lot of Bruce. That's a jersey box. That was a lot of Bruce. Yeah, we should have made up a jersey Bruce. box. Man. <laughs> what are you working with? On the job, the bump. I got Queens of the Stone right. Age, Stone Temple Pilots, Madonna, Dolly Parton, Cage the Elephant, Bruce Springsteen. <laughs> Janet Jackson, Ozzy, Blizzard of Oz, The Offspring. This one's coming out, right? Yes, this one comes out uh, Friday. Friday. Let me see what it says. It's the 20th anniversary edition with the bonus track, Hock It. Oh. Mm. Wait, it's got to focus. Okay, it focused. That's what I'm at. And then we've got Ariana Grande, and this one comes out on Friday, right? Yes, it does. Positions. Aliens. There's a bunch. More Ariana Grande. She's standing on her head. Pearl Jam, right? And they were yep. live. They were live. On Easy Street. Manchester Orchestra. And then we've got Kid Leroy. I okay. Think. Now, a lot of these are the ones that got released. Mm -hmm. But this isn't all the releases we actually have. No, no. Because it's only Tuesday. That's right. We've got a long time till Friday. And we got plenty more boxes mm -hmm. coming. There are going to be a bunch of releases out. Yes. So, you know, don't forget, if you pre-order uh, Ariana Grande right now, mm -hmm. or that Offspring, mm -hmm. we'll ship it out. Yes, we will. Because it's now in stock here. Mm -hmm. If it wasn't in stock here and you ordered it, it's coming from yeah. your distributor. Yeah. Because we wanted to put you in line before they came into here, because you never know if they're going to allocate them or not. Are we going to get 20, or are we going to get one? Never it's know. it's a tough call. Mm -hmm. So that's exactly why we throw them right over to the distributor as soon as we get those pre-orders in. Because mm -hmm. it puts you in line, not us in line. You're in line. So you can get it. And, and sometimes, a lot of the times, you guys are the ones that tell us mm -hmm. we need to order these things in. Like uh, the Paul McCartney and... Uh, Paul and Linda. The yeah. Lamb. Somebody pre-ordered that before I could even have a chance. So they're in line mm -hmm. at the distributor. Before us. Before us. <sighs> Crazy, right? Yes. We, we kicked those suckers right over. Mm -hmm. What else you working with? Oh, that's right. We got CDs. Well, we have an Ariana Grande cassette. Cassette? Cassette. 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 Let me see if I get it. Oh, what does it up there? Of course, focus is not its thing. Interesting, though. Okay. Now, I don't know what this is, but we had it for Record Store Day as a picture disc. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, to Matt. Are we sure we ordered these? No. <laughs> Five Finger Death Punch, <laughs> Breaking Benjamin, Bruce Dickinson, Nice, Battle Lore, Loretta Lynn, Calvary. I love, I love doing this to you. You can lift them up. I love doing this to her. I order in stuff that I think she's going to have a hard time Cavalera. It's Cavalera. I do this on purpose. Seven Kingdom, Veronica Lipgloss. This keeps selling. That's why it keeps getting ordered in. All right, let's see if we can't flip them forward a little bit. Okay, so we've got Metallica, Jenny Darren and the Lady Killers, nice. Molly Crew, Van Halen, Molly Hatchet, Rob Zombie, Venom, Shenanigans, Green Day, Metallica, yeah, Blackout, uh huh, Run, Run, Run Mahoy. Mm. Rum Ahoy. Ahoy, baby! Walk the plank! Wow. <laughs> You're close. <laughs> Molly Crew. Macrobah. Mmm, Macrobah. Macrobah. Yeah. Macrobah. 
Somebody had to correct us down in the comments last time. What? It's not Macroba? Who the heck knows? Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I'm trying. I got Metallica. There's a bunch of these Metallicas. And then we got this Metallica Leaves Eyes. Aliens. <laughs> Lacuna Coil. Deftones. Quiet Riot. Metallica. Audio Topsy. Mmm, Topsy Turby. <laughs> the Offspring. Kanye West. Fogarty's Factory. So I see CR. ACDC. More ACDC. Here Lies Love. I don't think I ordered that. Aliens. Original cast recording. Rihanna can hit the button too. Mm. Jay Z. The Outfield. Death Grips. Death Grips. And there's no sticker. Do, 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 do. Where's the sticker? I don't. I didn't think they put them on the CDs for Death Grips. I know, but still. Mm -hmm. I hear you. Mm -hmm. I hear you. Hey, to each their own, you know. But, what'd you think? We got stuff. Just a little bit here. You excited about Friday? I really am. I'm getting more and more excited about each and every Friday coming up from here, clear through the next month. Mm -hmm. You guys got to check out what's coming out. Some ridiculous stuff. It had to be stuff that was ready for Record Store Day. It had to be, because it's oh, so yeah. good. I have, <clears throat> I, I mean, I had... I don't even know if they kept them there. Mm -hmm. About 500 Panteras on back stock. Mm -hmm. If those suckers would have came in, I was cornering the market. Oh, yeah. But since they're re-reissuing them. Re-re-re. Yeah, re-re-reissuing re, 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 them. Re. It's a problem. Mm -hmm. But if you didn't order in those Panteras, because they are colored vinyl and all that other happy stuff, they are on SpinMeAroundStore.com. Mm -hmm. Right now on the front page, there's mm -hmm. four out of six of them there. Because they are releasing six different Panteras. Six and they're different. and of course they're limited edition. Obviously. I mean everything's limited edition. Obviously. What are they gonna do? Run out of the color blue? Or black? <laughs> like, come on, man. Or red? Yeah. White. I'm sorry, we can't make no more white vinyl ever. So We're that would out. be <laughs> there's no more white. Yeah, that would be limited. Well, how many mm -hmm. shades of red are there? So I just want to see things that are numbered. Mm-hmm. And if they're not numbered, I'm not I'm not counting them as limited. No. I'm just not. If they're not hand numbered, foil numbered, stamped, mm -hmm. peed on in a circle with a one or something, I don't care. It's gotta tell me it's really actually limited for me to fall for this baloney. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo -doo. Aliens. What you doing? I'm wrapping up spinaroundstore.com orders. What? Yes, spinaroundstore.com. Michael in Texas, guess what he bought? What? Guess. What? It looks like a Billie Eilish. Oh! Houston and the Dirty Rats. Yep, like the very last one that we have in the store. So we got to get Houston on that. Houston slacking. Mm -hmm. Big time. Slacktastic. Mm. I guess he doesn't realize how many of those things we actually sell of his. No, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so either. Mm -hmm. but yeah, it looks like you got a ton of different orders. I do. I got a bunch that are already done. So okay. yeah, they're you're getting a, out. You're ahead of the curb. So far, so good. You know what I keep hearing over here? Crickets chirping. Look at these things. They're so big. She bought the biggest crickets they had. I mean, they're scary big. I don't even know what the hell these two on the bottom are doing. Oh, it looks, it looks like they're doing something that you can't show on film. What do you mean? Because I've been watching them too. And they're doing something you can't show on film. I film it all the time. <laughs> one of them's asserting their dominance over the other one. That's what I love to film. What? I got it working. That's right, I got it working. God, you can load the cart too. And my bins are gonna fall. She's working hard for everybody. She works hard for that money. So hard for it, honey. She does, man. Don't forget, order spinaroundstore.com. Go to the super sales page, man. Yeah, because then we can ship that stuff out because that's the stuff we got. We got everything on that super sales page that's still in stock. Mm -hmm. The other stuff's iffy, you know, but super sales, the stuff that we show that we're like, oh my God, I'm so excited because Evanescence is the awesomest album ever. Yeah, that's what we got. And if you want that Ariana Grande, pre-order that sucker. Mm -hmm. Or the Offspring mm -hmm. that's coming out on Friday. Yep. We got it in stock. We do. I am absolutely in love with your shirt. Thank you got to stand up so people can read it. Be a nice human. Are you trying to say that there's aliens? There might possibly be. You know, you gave me one of the best presents I've had in a very long time. What's that? <laughs>
this epic book on conspiracies and secret societies. Oh, I thought of you immediately. <laughs> That's right. The Illuminati is real. Oh, I know they are. They really are. You know, I'm part of it. Oh, no, no, I'm not. Shh. Don't tell nobody. Your secret's safe with me. Aliens. Oh, man, he spots something. I don't see it, dude. I don't see it. You must see it. Is there anything? We put in the world's biggest crickets. I kid you not. These things are epically huge. He's eating good today. Let's see if I can find those crickets. What's up, buddy? Oh, man. All over the place back there. Oh, he got him. Totally took him wild. Alien. We have here today's Just Price Final Records, and they're awesome. They're so awesome. Do you know why they're so awesome? Yes, I do. Why is that? Because I see Led Zeppelin. I know, right? Led Zeppelin too. It's such a great album. So exciting. Now, here's the important question. What? Is it clean? Yes. Because the cover has got a little bit yes. of wear and tear. Yes. But, but the, the record, record itself? Mm -hmm. Excellent. And then we've got Nirvana in utero, and this one is the import version. That was like 2015. Okay, you imported mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. I love it. Beatles, Let It Be. Okay. David Bowie, Station to Station. Is that an original? Yes. Mmm, mm -hmm. because they do have all those reissues. No, 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 it's an original with that like goldish label. Okay. Beige gold. And then we got the Bee Gees, Odessa. Now the price sticker does not stick to the cover. So I had it's to put it. It's a felt cover, yeah, right? Yeah, because it's the, it's the felt cover. Okay. So yeah, so I had to put it on here. It won't last long. No, it won't. It, it never does. It doesn't. Especially if it's semi-clean. Mm -hmm. That thing will be gone. It's really clean. Ooh, and then we got Three Dog Night, and they were captured live. They were live at the forum. And did you know how they got their name? How did Three Dog Night get their name? Um, the one band member's girlfriend, June Fairchild, she was reading about Aboriginal Australians. And one of the things that they mentioned was that when it's really cold at night, they sleep with their dogs a dog so you know if it's cold there's one if it's really cold there's two if it's a freezing night it's a three dog night nice yes i didn't know that and she thought that sounded really cool do you know what june fairchild's famous for no she was an up and smoke okay Chi -chi -chong. Chi -chi -chong? Yeah. okay now that's now that's making some sense because mm -hmm. it's going to be a three dog night yep three dog mm. night and Three Dog Night was formed in 1967, and in the late 60s and early 70s, they had 21 top hits on, oh on the cow. Billboard Top 40, uh -huh. and three of them hit number one. Very cool. Cool, right? Yeah. Then we got Jimi Hendrix, Allman Brothers Band. It's super duper clean. We don't get nearly enough Allman Brothers Band. So I was very excited we to see We don't even get one. enough Dwight Allman or... Dwayne Allman, Dwayne none Allman, of them. Yeah. yeah, or any of them. I know, crazy. Oh, and we got Janis Joplin, Pearl. Now this is the original that opens this way. Ah. But then we got, this was 1971, this was 1975. So can you go wiki wiki woo? Because they opened together. Yes, you can. Oh, they were kissing? <laughs> yeah, they opened together. Janis was kissing her own butt. They opened together. Because it's facing the butt. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> And then we've got Woodstock. Everybody was kissing at Woodstock. Uh huh. And they were live. They were live at and Woodstock naked. and naked. They were live and naked uh -huh. at Woodstock. Uh huh. And wet and cold and hungry and high. Mm, mm hmm. Definitely. Yep. Definitely high. Definitely high. Cream. Jefferson Airplane. All right. And we got another Jefferson Airplane. And then we've got the band anthology volume one. What band? The band. The band? Bob Dylan's band. Okay, it's like the dude. Yeah, like the dude. Okay. The band. Jim Croce's Greatest Hits. Super group. Uh, Rolling Stones, Emotional Rescue. Great album. Elvis Country, Crosby, Stills, and Nash. No young, of not course yet. Not. No. Look, there had plenty of room on the couch for him instead. What? This dude they were, kicked that dude no, right they off were, the couch. No, he was still doing his own thing. I don't buy it. He was still doing his own thing. It was just Crosby, Stills, and Nash at that point. Mm. Mm -hmm. He was writing a little ditty. He's always writing a little ditty. He's written a million little ditties. I can't wait for him to sell his catalog. I want to see how much he gets. 50 Cent. No, he's going to get a lot more than 50 that. 50 Cent per song, just, and he's going to get more than all of them. He just keeps going and going yeah, no. and going. It's crazy. He's still putting out albums, mm -hmm. which is nuts. Yeah, it was like one every month for yeah. 2021. So, uh, Quicksilver, 
I almost said silver chair. <laughs> Mama's big ones. Oh, wow, I wonder what cats. you're thinking of. Nice. Boston. Do, do, do. Aliens. And there's two. There's two. So you can go wiki wiki woo. With Boston. Yes. Do you want to know a fun fact about these? Hit it. They were both from Selling Tales. Really? Yes. Somebody sold them back to you. Yes. They had Selling Tales stickers. Oh. You can kind of see the, yeah, the little teeny tiny Selling Tales. Okay. Yeah. So somebody bought them from us like six, seven years ago. Yeah. For like $2.50. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Baby Grand. Whoa. Was that a piece of broccoli? It's a whole face of... Uh... Yeah. There's a pepper. Um, they're root vegetables. I can't... The Leeks? Root, the root... The roof is on fire. I think those are potatoes. Oh man, I think I still got a more epic beard than him. Probably. What? Yeah, but his is two tone, just like yours. Man, listen, yesterday, uh -huh. my son, I was hanging out with him all day. Mm -hmm. He ripped out my beard hairs, my two favorite be <laughs> beard hairs. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Beard hairs? Yes. My two favorites, though. How do you know which ones are your favorites? Because <sighs> they're the ones that hurt the most. <laughs> We got the history of British rock. So we got the Kinks, Dave Clark Five, Bee Gees. Todd uh, Stewart. Yeah. Uriah Heep. Uriah Heep. Hollies. That's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Freddie and the Dreamers, Cliff Richard. Yeah. All right. Yeah. That's a hell of a comp. Mm hmm. Abba's Greatest Hits. Disco Queen must be on there. Star Castle. Nick Gilder. Barry Manlow's Greatest Hits. Hooters. You know everything there is to know about Hooters. I know. I do now. It's so exciting. Mmm. And then we've got Barry Gibb. Andy Gibb. Andy Gibb. Andy Gibb. Andy Gibb. Sorry. Isn't that a BG? No, he was a BG brother. Ah, close enough. He was like the younger brother of BGs. He was like Marky Mark. Wow. He was, he was the funky bunch? He was the younger bunch? brother. Well, nice. He was the younger brother. Uh, Bobby V. Bobby V. And there's another one of those. Gary Puckett in the Union Gap, Chicago, and then we got Curtis Bayfield Superfly soundtrack. But it oh, doesn't it doesn't do have the, the flip. Thing. It doesn't have the flip. It doesn't do the thing. It's the reissue. It's the reissue. Still a help. <laughs> Superfly, great album. Together Brothers, Barry White. Forget the soundtrack. album. It's a great movie. Mm -hmm. Superfly. Mm -hmm. Sorry. And then we've got all this and World War II soundtrack, the Forty Five King. It says it was hip hop, but it's James Brown. Hmm. Early, and early. The probably. Honey Drippers. Early hip hop, then I guess some funk. So I, I was a little thrown off. Yeah, I don't get that. They can't always be right. Oh, well, there is a little bit of hip hop on mm -hmm. there, apparently. Yeah. Produced by DJ Mark, the Forty Five King. That's right. I think the 45 Kings, Jersey, New York, it's around here. Mm -hmm. I think the label was around here. I don't know if it still is or not. Finesse and Synquest, and there's two of those. Soul Sisters, and then we got the Black Flames, and there's two of those from the Lesson Zero soundtrack. Herbert Laws, for Full Circle, uh, Myth America is Fusion Jazz. Duke Ellington's 70th birthday concert, so he was live, he was live. Stevie Wonder, Songs in the Key of Life, and it's got the book, and it's got the 7-inch. What? Two records, the book, and the 7-inch. Hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm wondering where the ding, ding, ding came from, because Katie's up front. Mm hmm Somebody else is in the back. Mm hmm Where the hell did the ding, ding, ding possibly come from? Did they go out the door that doesn't have the air curtain? I think there was an alien. Alien? Just saying. Freaked alien. me out a little bit, because I'm standing here like... Alien. 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 Doo -doo -doo -doo. What? <laughs> then we got War's Greatest Hits. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Mm. Love Child, Diana Ross and the Supremes. And we got another Diana Ross and the Supremes. Then we got Diana Ross by herself. And then we have Rick James throwing down. And guess what? What? It says, it claims that this one is P-Funk. But you know whose name is nowhere on there? Couldn't possibly be George Clinton. George Clinton is nowhere on there, so it can't possibly be P-Funk. I guess, I bet you his name is on there. It's probably Bootsy. Bootsy's probably on there. Producer. Whoa. Uh-huh. Whoa. Uh-huh. That's some serious stuff right there. I'm uh -huh. going to have to do some investigating. Yeah. Yeah. Did Rick James really say, F you, George yeah, Clinton? That's I'm what, taking P-Funk. That's what I'm saying. I don't see George Clinton's name on here anywhere. All right, somebody let us know down below, man. 
Is it P-Funk? It's a great album. It claims to be P-Funk, and it's like, how could it be P-Funk if George Clinton is not on there anywhere? Listen, it, it's it's like rock funk. Mm -hmm. It's a pretty badass album. I, mm -hmm. I've listened to it several times. Mm -hmm. Don't know if I'd qualify that as P-Funk. It to be P-Funk. All right. Peebo Bison. Maybe I just don't know really what P-Funk is. Walt Disney's Uncle Remus. Other than Parliament. <laughs> the Jungle Book. Oh, then we got 12 inch singles. We got Tough oh, City Tough Records. Tough City Records. Mm -hmm. Jersey. Mm -hmm. Love those dudes. They shouted us out. Moby. Who cares about no Moby? I love Moby. What? I love Moby. You're the only one who loves Moby. I love Moby. Mm, I like every one of his commercials. <laughs> Mantis and Omega. Mitchell Foreman. Jazz. Hip hop. Hip hop. Uh, turn it. Flip it. There you go. Now you can read it. Yep. The Flavor Unit MCs. All right. Hopefully you didn't put too much on that one. Andy Norell. Grace Jones. Pull up to the bumper. Pull up to the bumper, baby. What? You know something? What? I need to pull. Do you? Yes, so we can't exactly go out there because there's too many people. So I'm going to pick some books. Okay. Either we could do a movie right there. We could do a movie right there. I'll totally throw my mask on. Okay. Huh. Okay. See, look at that. I'm pretty again. I know right what I'm going for already. I'm going to kick her butt with this one. Huh. I don't know, man. I'm going to put that one back and go up to that one. Catwoman, what? The blade, whole thing. There's 10 tons of movies. These uh, Indiana Jones are actually available on uh, uh, Paramount. We just subscribed to Paramount, which was really, really interesting. Sahara, loved that movie too. Oh, look at that, everybody's kind of disappeared. Got some hip hop. What? How did Rob Bass get in my hip hop? Somebody explain that. Aliens stole my hip hop. That's right. What you working with? I got Cheech and Chong up in smoke. Oh yeah? You're uh -huh. gonna put that up against my apocalypse now? Hmm. That's right. That's right. I think I won. Bottom of the screen. Gotta vote on this epic poll. Is it her Cheech and Chong? Or is it my apocalypse now? I don't know. I kinda like yours, but I really like mine too. Depending on the mood I'm in. So let me know what type of mood you're in tonight, because if you're in the mood for Apocalypse Now, we all might be in some shit. Did you know I'm leaving? I do now. Yes, I'm leaving. Well, I'm on a jet plane, don't know <laughs> when I'll be back again. Tomorrow. Leaving. You'll be back tomorrow. Damn it. What do you mean, voice. damn it? <laughs> I'm excited to come in tomorrow. Good, I'm glad. I get, to, I, I get to go through all those brand new records. Yes, yes And open up another 45,000 boxes that yes. are sure to come tomorrow. Yes, so yes it's going to be the best day ever. That's with right. With more of the new releases for Friday, I'm sure. It's going to be ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Ooh, lots of stuff. That's right. And then hopefully we'll rock the record store and there'll be a zillion people. Mm -hmm. Oh, we definitely will. I heard a rumor. What's that? I heard Rihanna gave up on Wednesdays. Really? Mmm. Did you? I want to give up on Wednesdays too now. If she could do it, I could do it, right? But you just said you were excited about coming in tomorrow. Yeah, what but happened? still. <sighs> Bam. I'm leaving. Have a good night. <laughs> oh, Ooh, I want to take you. But first, they got to leave us a comment and let us know the favorite record in that box or unboxing was because we had some really awesome stuff. They got to give us a like, a big old thumbs up. Because everyone likes to thumbs up because when you do good, you get good. And then they have to subscribe. 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 Ring that bell. Ding, ding, ding. Because we do it really like this a lot. And we'll see you soon. No, you, you know what they got to do first? What? They got to go to spinmearoundstore.com. Check out the super sales page. Mm -hmm. They should do that. Because I, I am adding some epic stuff. Mm -hmm. It's not me actually adding it, though. It's Rihanna, mm -hmm. who's an invisible ghost in the store right now. Okay. You can't find her. <laughs> nanny, nanny, poo, poo. Aliens. Especially yes, especially <laughs> Wednesdays. You can't find her. She's an alien. We're going to the coolest place in the whole world. <laughs> right now. Right, Mama? Right, Papa. Does any can anybody guess where we are or what we're doing? I mean, there is some stuff up there. We're not exactly sure what it is. But what are we doing here? We're getting bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. All right. Lots bubble. of bubble wrap. That's right. We show up at the bubble wrap factory uh -huh. at 7.45 <laughs> at night and we buy bubble wrap. Yes.
This is what we do. You put money in the box and That's you take your bubble wrap. Exactly. Exactly. But you better make sure you get some decent rolls. Uh -huh. Otherwise, and if they're not perforated. Yeah, then you're screwed. And half the time they're half perforated and you're half screwed because the rest of it isn't. And then it'll start again magically. And then it'll stop and it'll start. It's the weirdest thing. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I like that analogy. Half screwed. Or half screwed. Yeah. Is half screwed like okay or is half screwed like bad? It's kind of like partially I finished, screwed. Yeah, it's kind of like I finished too early. Yeah. What?